um, cross over to the Clotic Hall Lake constituency where uh, Dr. Ezenato Rollins is addressing, um, I believe, believe some people gathered there or so. So we'll take a listen to that and then we come back to continue here. Hello, Thierry. Hello. Can you hear me, Thierry? Yes, I can hear you. Very well, sure. So um, let us know what's happening there. Uh, quickly, if you could brief us. Okay, so, okay, so what you have here is, uh, you know, Dr. Janet Rollins uh, winning the team, retaining the team that she won in 2016. Uh, well, she beat Prince uh, Apia this time around. Then, uh, it was against Philip Addison. She won that. And that's why, um, you know, at this point, 20, always been a swing after eight years. And um, Zanetta Rollins is proving the difference for the NDC in this point, 20. And she's retained the seat yet again. As you can see, the, the party official joined her here after she was announced the winner of this point, 20, uh, for the second time running. They are here uh, to listen to her for the very first time, her acceptance speech, and of course, to uh, give her the best of wishes going into the next four years. That's what you have here at the Accra Art Center. She came here just about uh, 10 minutes ago, and the party officials have been in very jubilant mood. They have not even allowed her to, to say a word. Um, so we are waiting for her to begin um, with her speech. But as it is right now, it is the NDC um, winning this particular seat in the parliamentary session as well as the presidential, because um, Nana Dranko the president, won in 2016, and that was supposed to uh, continue the norm of eight years giving every party since 1992. But there has been a flip in this constituency. It is uh, John Dramani Mahama, His Excellency, that has won this particular seat, a seat he won in 2012. He lost it in 2016. He's regained it in 2020. So that is the situation here. NDC have won this in the presidential and the parliamentary. And as you can see behind me here, is the uh, candidate of the NDC as well as the incumbent, the Honorable uh, Zanetta Rollins, the daughter of the former president, Jerry John Rollins. She joined the party fans, uh, the, the party officials, and of course, some sympathizers too, uh, jubilate after she regained her seat. Maybe you can pick a bit of the ambience before she uh, delivers her speech. Right. Um, Theory, uh, we would have to, you know, come back to you because uh, the connection is not the best. Um, Dr. Nino Note, your thoughts on this? I mean, the earlier press briefing and then this um, declaration of Dr. Zanata Rollins as, you know, the parliamentary candidate-elect. Yes, Colleg Clote, as uh, you've seen in our uh, presentations earlier, um, Steve, you re recall that we said it was really a neck-to-neck -neck yes. affair. And indeed, it has lived to that expectation. So we said it could go either, either way. way. Mm. And uh, I think she has done well to have retained the seat. Mm. Because usually, they don't normally retain, retain <laughs> uh, the incumbent. Yes. Right. That's interesting. Stephen, do you, you want to, do you want to believe that maybe uh, sympathies of the father's passing helped or uh, it's because Zenato has been on the ground? I, I, I think that she has been on the ground mm -hmm. and that she uh, consistently has been charting a political mm -hmm. image for herself to try and remove herself mm -hmm. from the image of her father and her mother. And I think uh, this, this is good for her and it to push her one step up the ladder. Don't forget that Ezenato Rollins doing the uh, name calling for who will be the running mate for uh, John Romani Mahama was mentioned. Mm -hmm. It's not to suggest that uh, she couldn't have qualified to be a running mate for the NDC, but she's the one to look out for over the next couple of years. Uh, for uh, We have uh, pictures or videos uh, where the EC is about to declare um, um, as a NATO, Dr. Zanato Rollins as the um, winner of the Clote Kole constituency. So we'll take that video and do uh, remember that we'll be bringing you, you know, live videos as and when uh, they do come up for you to see what is happening 
from all across um, the 16 regions, indeed the 275 constituencies. Let's take a look at this uh, video from Klote Kwale. PNC had 14, PP had 43, NDP had 21, and the independent candidate had 11. A total of 70,888 votes was cast for this 2020 election. The Total rejected vote for the constitution. Right, so uh, those were scenes from Kwale Klote where uh, the EC was declaring um, Dr. Zenato Ajiman Rollins as the winner of uh, the parliamentary elections there uh, in the December 2020. Um, elections. And so it's a done deal now. It is a done deal. Yeah. Um, it is a done deal. And if you look at the presidential record as well, it means that then some more votes have been shored up mm. for uh, the NDC. And uh, they, so this is a skirt, skirt win. <laughs> you, you will not skirt and blouse. Yeah, about 8,000 votes. Exactly. That, that's pretty cool. In yeah. Accra. That's, that's, a, that's, 